Hey guys, welcome back to Next Channel Blogger and in this video, I want to show you how you can create a sliced text effect in the game software. Now, it's actually super easy to create a sliced text effect in GIMP. So without further delay, let's get started. Now, the first thing which we will do is we will create a new image with a transparent background. So go to file and click on new and let the width and height of the new image be 1280 and 720 now click on advanced options and select transparency inside fill width and then click on ok perfect now the next thing which we will do is we will apply a particular color on top of our image so select foreground color and write this html notation inside this html notation text box so write 16 three two eight five and then click on ok now go to edit and select fill with foreground color all right now the next thing which we will do is we will write some text on top of our image and so select the text tool from the toolbox and write some text so let me just write let's say sliced and let me just change the text color to white let me also change the font to Montserrat heavy and let me increase the font size to somewhere around 250 pixels perfect now let me just use the alignment tool to align my text in the center of the image and so let me just go to tools go to transform tools and right here you will find the alignment tool so select that select your text and align your text in the center of the image perfect now the next thing which we will do is we will use the free select selection tool to create a slice between our text and um, we will use the free select selection tool but before that we need to do one thing we need to go to layer and select this particular option layer to image size so select that and now go to tools go to selection tools and right here you will find the free select selection tool so select that and start creating that slice effect between your text so let me just place my first point somewhere right here and right here is my second point right here is my third point And finally, right here is my selection. Perfect. Press enter on the keyboard. And now what we will do is we will go to edit and we will select cut. Then we will go to edit once again and go to paste as and select new layer. Perfect. Now go to image, sorry, go to layer and select layer to image size. And finally, go to select and then click on none. Now, all you need to do is use the move tool to move the upper part of the cut a little to the left. And so select the move tool from the toolbox and select the upper part of the text and move it little to the left like this. And right here, as you can see, that slice is properly visible. This looks perfect. You can adjust this according to your choice. And right here, this looks perfect to me. And so one final thing, one final thing which I would like to do is I would like to add a little shadow and so normally in such cases you add the drop shadow but I would like to add a long shadow so go to filters go to light and shadow and right here you will find this long shadow option so select that and first of all let me just change the color to black and 
let me just decrease the length so currently the length is 100 so let me just decrease the length to somewhere around to somewhere around just a second to somewhere around 19 18 this looks this looks perfect 10.2 this looks perfect and finally let me just click on ok I may also add the long shadow effect on the bottom part of my text and so select the bottom part the sliced and go to filters go to light and shadow select long shadow once again and let me just change the color to black and let me just decrease the length to 10.2 once again so let me just write 10.2 perfect and then click on ok so that's it guys this is how you can create a sliced text effect in the game software do let me know your thoughts in the coming section below like the video and subscribe to my youtube channel i will again see you in the next video till then thanks for watching